Hello and welcome to the tutorial on addition. In this tutorial we will learn how to add three digit numbers and tens. And what we mean by tens is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, all the way to 90. And we're going to do this in the horizontal format. So let's begin with our first example. Okay, this is a nice easy one. 327 plus 40. 327 plus 40. It's a plus sign. Now let's label the digits on the right. For 327, the 7 is the units. For 40, the 0 is the units. So we're adding the 7 and the 0. That means it remains the same. 7 plus 0 is 7. The units does not change. Okay, that remains the same. Whenever you're adding tens, the units do not change because it's 0. So now let's move on to the tens. Here we're adding 2 and 4. 2 plus 4. So what is 2 plus 4? The answer is 6. You know that. And the hundreds, 3 remains the same. Now that's not always the case. The hundreds can change. And we will come to that shortly. But in this example, 327 plus 40 is 367. The only digit which has changed, and I'll highlight it here, is the 6. Units does not change. The hundreds may or may not change. Okay, so let's move to our second example. And this one is a bit more tricky. 564 plus 60. Now we'll do this the same way. Notice the plus sign. We always point that out. Okay, the units. What do we notice here? It doesn't change. 4 plus 0 is 4. That was the easy part. Now let's move on to the tens. And what do we notice here? We're adding 6 and 6. Now 6 plus 6 is more than 10. 6 plus 6 is 12. Now how do we work this out? We don't want to use the vertical format. Okay, we can do it that way. What we're going to do is this. We're going to look at the digit on to the left of the tens. So we're going to join these two together. We're going to say 56. Not 506 tens, it's 56 tens. So we've got 56 tens. And don't forget we're adding this 6 over here. It's plus 6. So what is 56 plus 6? Well, you can use the dot method. You can use the fingers on your hands. But realistically, you should know this by now. You should be able to work this out. Okay, 6 plus 6 is 12. So therefore, 56 plus 6 is 62. At this level, you should be able to do this pretty quickly. Okay, so that has changed. 56 has gone to 62. The 4 over here hasn't changed. So our answer is 624. The 4 didn't change. 56 became 62 because we were adding 6. Scroll down. We're going to work on one more. This time we have 898 plus 80. So 898 plus 80. Now how do we do this? In exactly the same way. Notice the plus sign to begin with. I'm just going to highlight the units because I know y you know this by now. 8 plus 0 is 8. Let's move on to the tens. 
we're going to join the ones on the left together. So we've got 89. On the right hand side, we've got 8. So we're 8 and 89. So what is 89 plus 8? Now again, you're counting just simply 8. You should be able to do this in your head by now. 89 plus 8 is 97. So therefore, our answer becomes 978. 898 plus 80 is 978. Those two digits have changed. The 8 has not changed. And that is how we add three-digit numbers and tens in the horizontal format.